And welcome back to KTN News Desk. I'm Michael Karanja. Now, the global remittance market has seen a lot of competition from financial institutions trying to jostle for a share of this. And one of those institutions is, happens to be MoneyGram. And today I'm joined by the CEO of MoneyGram, Pam Patsley, who just come from signing a partnership with Safaricom for the M-Pesa platform. So, why Safaricom and why the mobile money platform in terms of sending, and uh, sending money from, from abroad? Okay. Well, it's wonderful to be here, and thank you for your interest in MoneyGram today. We're very excited about our partnership with Safaricom. We're in the global remittance business. We have been in Kenya for probably 15 years, and the growth the last five years of M-Pesa, electronic wallets, mobile wallets for consumers, we need to be able to allow Kenyans to receive money through MoneyGram into something they use each and every day yeah. for their everyday purchases. In the past, you've partnered with uh, banks and uh, forex players, perhaps. Why the sh sudden shift to mobile money uh, to transfer in terms of the remittances? Yeah, I, I look at it as more of an addition as opposed to a shift. So our banks, we have fabulous bank partners here in Kenya. They remain our partners. But we, you know, we have a philosophy that any way a consumer wants to send money from the send side to any way a consumer wants to receive money, we would like to facilitate that. And I think it will provide a tremendous service to Kenyans and to the diaspora outside of Kenya, providing a more convenient way, perhaps for their receiver to um, get the money in their mobile wallet. Yeah, and uh, sending money is really a two-way street because we do have Kenyans who actually live abroad. So with, with Safaricom, will I be able to send money now through the M-Pesa platform to a MoneyGram account to, say, someone in uh, Dallas? Yeah, that'd really be talking. nice. Yeah, you could, you could do that, but uh, yeah. not yet. Uh -huh. Right now, we are launching uh, with M-Pesa Safaricom in Kenya, the receive side. So it um, will be available through 90 countries in the MoneyGram network. We're today in over 200 countries. Yeah. We're launching this with 90. The predominance of the business right now will be coming out of the U.S., the U.K., Canada, and the Middle East. But it will be available in 90, and we hope to expand that from there to the full 200. Yeah. What, the, the, one of the reasons M-Pesa has become very successful was that they were able to lower the costs of sending and receiving money. Uh, yeah. That's perhaps why they bypassed yourselves and other perhaps uh, money sending agents. So in, the, in your partnership, have you made it uh, in such a way that it's, it entices customers to use the M-Pesa platform to, to receive and send money? Yeah, I think it's mostly the convenience factor that's the biggest enticement. Yeah. You know, where M-Pesa, as you say, kind of um, went around or didn't go through some of the large global money transfer providers such as MoneyGram, yeah. that was really more for intra-Kenya transactions. When you get into cross-border transactions, the compliance requirements on both sides Science. of that transaction are quite extensive. And so that's why it's attractive to Safaricom to partner with someone like MoneyGram, and then certainly it's attractive for us to partner with them because of having over 15 million in growing wallets here in Kenya. Yeah, I was listening to you for as you, at your signing uh, function today, and uh, three words came out: quick, fast, and, rel and, and uh, reliable. Mm -hmm. Do you stick to that mantra? We do stick to that mantra: quick, fast, and reliable. Secure. You could throw that one in. Yeah. And we really kind of think about our service as fulfilling one of three needs it's emergency cash it's celebrating life's big moments it's a birthday it's a graduation it's back to school something like that and then it's just for everyday life's essentials yeah. so it's really a brand that you know tugs at the heart of people for families and friends yeah. Kenya alone accounts for about 1.8 billion shillings in terms of annual remittances what kind of uh, share of this are you looking for? What's the plan exactly in terms of being a uh, being a, a major player in the da in the in the remittance uh, in the remittance market? Yeah. So MoneyGram is today the second largest global remittance company in yeah. the world, and uh, we look to to continue to grow. I have shared with some people last night. You know, here in Kenya, our business is growing. What I like to refer to as double digit. Yeah. And uh, we certainly think with this Impesa launch and partnership with Safaricom that we'll be able to maintain and actually even accelerate to perhaps some higher double digits than what we've been seeing. So how important are frontier markets such as Kenya or developing countries for the likes of MoneyGram in terms of looking for new markets to, you know, yep. show up uh, revenues and actually profit for profitability for the company? 
Yeah, it, it is. Uh, so we've been, like I said, in most countries for at least 10 years, in yeah. Kenya for probably 15. So it's not so much that the country itself is a new frontier, but it's the way we provide and facilitate our service that kind of makes it more in the frontier. So it's adapting to mobile wallets. It's using MoneyGram Online. You can send from MoneyGram Online into an M-Pesa wallet here. Yeah. So that's, you know, no no point of sale presence. It's basically electronic to electronic. We're seeing the same thing with our partner in Qatar, Uridu, where the mobile money is used on the SIN side there from Kenyans working in Qatar, yeah. and they can send back to, so that's really mobile wallet to mobile wallet. MoneyGram plays a very vital role in the middle, providing and facilitating settlement on both ends of that transaction, and of course all the compliance in between. All right. Obviously now you're in Kenya. Which other markets interest you, especially on the African continent? Yeah, I, I, I hate that question because I feel like I'm always going to leave someone out. I mean, there is no place. What I, you what know, I must have your top five. <laughs> so, so I would point you to the size of the market that they yeah, are, yeah. As, as reported as by indicator. the World Bank. Exactly. But, you know, it takes each, you know, uh, country pair and corridor. So we yeah. really look at our business between the sending country and the receiving country. So it's not just... Kenya alone, it's U.S. Kenya, U.K. Kenya, Middle East Kenya, you know, so we look at that from a corridor perspective. Yeah. Um, and, you know, I don't think money grams that end of job any place yeah. that, that we're present. So we have a lot of runway for growth. Further to the partnership, you recently set up a regional office in Nairobi. Yep. How do you plan, does that give confidence to you as uh, Nairobi is one of those financial services uh, hubs that you actually look into grow into other countries in the region? Yeah, we, we chose Nairobi um, b because of really, it's just a great place to kind of hang our shingle, if you will, for an office. Yep. And uh, I think the infrastructure, the business yep. climate, it really is, is an attractor, if you will, for what we're trying to do in the region. So it'll be our Nairobi office, and we will manage kind of seven surrounding countries from this office. All right. So we're excited about growing here in Nairobi from our own employment perspective as well. 1,300 outlets in Kenya, most of them through partnerships. Are you looking to set up your own branded kind of outlets for MoneyGram services? We're not. We like yeah. our partnership arrangement here in Kenya, and right now we're very happy. We, we have wonderful bank partners. We're extremely excited about our partnership with Safaricom, so I don't see the need for us to become licensed and then take on that other responsibility. I think we have a good way to reach the consumers. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you. That has been Pam Parsley, Chairman and CEO of MoneyGram, just telling us about the excitement in, in terms of the playing in that remittance market.